that you're going to want to start with lemonade or any primer, anything that you got that you think will do the trick. You can even use concealer. I started off using concealer um, and it works just as well as any primer, but I thought I'd try getting a primer. Meh. Put that over the whole of your eyelid. Like that. Ow! Don't trap your finger in that when you shut it. Then I'm going to use Collection 2000 Dreamland. Nope, too blurry. It's a light green colour. Get a full brush. and like dab it in there so you have it on your brush and then put that over the whole eyelid no 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 don't put it on the first half of the eyelid <laughs> okay just dab that on so you've got it on the first half of the eye then get Barry M Dazzle Dust in 72 which is like an emerald green and it's gorgeous that's colour. Gorgeous. Right. Get a bit on your brush. And then tap it into the lid just to sort of really get it into the brush. And then do the outer half. And go up to the crease. And then blend the two together. So you've got it on both eyes and I've taken it just above the crease. I'm just going to get any white eyeshadow. I really do need to get a new one because mine has... Oh no, see? Mine has kind of like fallen to bits. This one is W7 Igloo. Yeah, I don't know. And then just do your highlight with that. into the green also get a white eyeliner and just do the inside of your eye whilst you're here like that and then use your finger to just blend that white in and then we're just going to set that using a white eyeshadow again. Just a very small brush. If I can find it, I'll use that. Just like that. Then get. Number, it's a collection 2000 Dazzle Me again, it's number 18 in key. It is black, well it's a glittery black. And I'm going to get my round gosh brush. Or you can use any sort of crease brush. Don't get very much on there. And then you're just going to go into the crease over the edge. Just to darken it a bit. Just like that, so you've got quite a subtle darkening. Um, then you're going to apply liquid eyeliner on the top, so I'm going to go away and do that. But if you click um, here, then I will try and put a link to my eyeliner tutorial so you know what I'm doing. Okay, so eyeliner is applied. Next, liquid eyeliner. Next, I'm going to use 
um, coal eyeliner pencil and um, this is Benefit's waterproof one you have to get it it's £13.50 I think it is and oh my god I've done 11 hour days 12 hour days at work and this has been on the whole time on my waterline it's so worth the investment so I'm just going to put that on my waterline And then just to darken this look out a bit more, I'm just going to put a tiny bit underneath and then use the smudger on the other end and just smudge that in a bit. Just to give it a bit of a, like, a more intense look. Okay, next, mascara. I'm going to use my Maybelline Colossal. And you can use false eyelashes for this look. Um, if you do, then I suggest you put the false eyelashes on before you put on the eyeliner. And there we go. I have to apologise for lighting because when I started this, it was quite light outside. Now it's gone dark, so sorry about that. Um, for lips, that's the eyes done. I'm just going to use, but I love this stuff now. I only bought it yesterday, and I love it. Um, it's number seven, Licklicious in Marshmallow. I'm just going to. Okay, a bit too much on there. Just like that. And there's your look completed. Hey ho! Um, start with. Okay, so you've got it on the first half of the eye. Then, get. Uh, oh, oh. 